How's it going guys? Welcome back to the channel and today I have a product review video for you. I use three different wheel cleaners that I use in my details. So I will be going over these product with you and how to use it and you will get to see some dirty wheels being cleaned. So sit back, relax and enjoy the show and let's begin. So for the first product I have is Super Clean Degreaser. I've been using this degreaser for a long time. I use this mainly on all my tires uh, and especially sometimes when I have like dirty wheels or everything, first thing I do is use Super Clean. It breaks down all the dust and it will break down all the grime that is sticking in there, in the wheels actually and this we, this car i washed after we had the winter storm in texas so these wheels were very dirty so first thing i do is make sure all the wheel wells and the wheel barrels i soak them in super clean i spray the product on there and as you can see it sits there for a few uh, minutes uh, maybe two or three minutes and by the time i clean the wheel barrel and the wheel wells so this gives the time for super clean to sit on the tires and break down all that dust and the grime that is sticking to it and super clean works in many ways you can use it in your house you have to dilute it and here i'm using a uh, one-to-one -one because on the wheels i use a uh, one-to-one -one ratio for super clean and this is really really good cleaner i've been using super clean for a long time and it works really well i coat the wheels second times with the second time with the product because I don't like it to dry because super clean will leave some marks if it dries on the wheels so it's always good to make sure that the wheel is wet and you are not letting the product dry and as you can see the tire is getting cleaned because the first time we sprayed it and it brought down all the grime that was sticking to it and it makes the job easier give you a little overview of the product so super clean i use most of the time on my wheels and i buy it by the two gallon bottle that i get it from walmart and this is 22 dollars worth of product that i get and i dilute it so i mainly use super clean on my wheels for all the details most of the time and this product is really good uh, i have been using it for a while so like i mentioned and this product works on the tires the wheel wells the wheel barrels and everything and sometimes this product is not the only product that i use on the wheels why because some cars have heavier brake dust that comes off of it and it gets stuck to the wheels and so I have to use some of the product to make sure that everything comes out but most of the time this super clean gets the job done and this is a really amazing product so for the cost and what it does the job it's a really efficient product The second product that I have here for you is the Turtle Wax Wheel and Tire Cleaner. I picked it up from Walmart and as you can see this wheel was really dirty. Look at all the black stuff that just the sp spraying of water is just pulling it out. The pressure washer is just doing its job and is taking off all the loose dust from the wheels. So I used this product on this wheel because this was really grungy wheel so I wanted to push the product to its limit and see how it performs so my step of cleaning wheels is i clean the wheel wells first and then i spray down the tire so it when i'm cleaning the wheel wells it gives the time for the product to sit on the tire and it eats up all that gunk that is there so as you see as soon as i spray the uh, turtle wax wheel and tire cleaner on the tires all the brown stuff started coming out that is the blooming of the wheels 
it removes it is that brown stuff that comes out of the tires so if the wheels are not all the tires is not cleaned properly the tire dressing does not stick to it and it does not look good so after cleaning the tires I move into the wheel barrel that is with a soft brush I try to clean as much as I can on the inside and then I reach for the outside of the wheel with a soft bristle brush I clean all the outside of the wheels and make sure I go through all the lug nuts and everything to make sure that the wheel is completely clean and you can see the product is really doing its job over here but for this wheels I had to do it twice because this was really really dirty car and had a lot of brake dust on the wheels and turtle wax did the job so far and I had to apply the product again and it did do the job so overview of the product for three dollars and ninety seven cents uh, this is not a bad product but if you have like really dirty dirty wheels um, I would not say this is the product to use and this will be you have to do the process about two to three times to make sure as you can see the second time also how much brown stuff came out of the tire so if you are looking for a product that you want to use just on your car and you just want to buy something this works really well if your wheels are not dirty too bad but overall this product for the price is really good and it did do the job and will I keep using this one not really but it just depends on the detail that I have I try to decide which product to use so this one not did not do the job for this car so my end review will be that if you have like a car that is less grungier or the wheels are not that dirty this product really does the job As you guys could see in the first picture, I did buy some wheel woolies to clean the wheels on all my details. If you're on a budget, this is a really good brush to work with, but wheel woolies are the safest thing to use on wheels. And as you can see, the wheel woolies are really, really protected. They don't have any metal wires inside it, none of that sort. So it does not scratch your wheels at all. The brushes, they are cheap, but sometimes you can end up scratching. So I had to ditch that and go with the wheel woolies. The package that I bought, it came with three brushes. So if it does not, uh, this big one does not fit in your wheel well, you can always, oh sorry, the wheelbarrow, you can always use the other two they are a little bit smaller and they go through all the wheel barrels and everything it cleans so well as you can see I will be using the new PNS brake buster that I just bought and this product I'll be using on my Subaru wheels my Subi wheels are ceramic coated so these were really dirty wheels and as you can see the wheels are grungy they have a lot of brake dust sticking to it a lot of dirt grime so again, first thing, just spray off the wheel with water and the wheel wells. In this one, I I use the PNS Brake Buster on my wheel well as well. I just wanted to see what it can do. Just the wheels or can it clean the plastics that is inside the wheel well and make sure to clean it properly. If it does a job, let me see how far I can push the product. So as you can see I'm washing the wheel right now so I'll go over the product. So PNS Brake Buster it comes I think in a gallon bottle and it costs $27 for a gallon. It is a little pricey product but as you can see over here as soon as I spray it on the 
tires all the brown stuff is just coming off and when I sprayed it on my wheel it just started pulling all the brake dust off uh, the first time I used this product was on the Hellcat detail that I did uh, a couple of weeks ago and I will put the link on to your right and you can click on it and watch the video I did use the PNS brake buster on those wheels and it did an amazing job and on these wheels that I'm using my wheels are ceramic coated so the brake dust doesn't really stick that well I mean there are some times that some other stuff will get stuck on it so the PNS brake buster really did the job and the next I'm going to be using is my new wheel woolies that I bought they are one of the best things you can have if you're a detailer out there I would really recommend to use these on your details because sometimes those brushes can scratch the wheels so I had to ditch that and get these and they really work they come with three different brushes like I mentioned earlier so in this one you can see to clean behind the spokes I use the curved one and when you don't I don't have much space to go behind the uh, brake calipers I use the small one that can go through the little space that is there and these brushes are really awesome so just to give my opinion on the three products super clean is my everyday go-to product uh, turtle wax it's a really good product but if you have heavily grunging wheels uh, it may not be the good uh, product to go for but for a regular average clean for three dollar ninety seven cents it really does the job and overall PNS brake buster takes my win because I can use it on any sort of wheel I can dilute it uh, for this uh, detail or any other detail I do uh, one to one ratio on that one and this is a really amazing product PNS Brake Buster so if you guys are really looking for wheel cleaners those are my top three and to clean my wheels I use Gion wet coat that is just a booster for the ceramic coating I just spray it on and use a pressure washer to just wash it off and it increases the hydrophobicity of the wheels and just like that guys these wheels are really clean and these are the products that I use on my details and as you can see the water just beads off of those wheels ceramic coating is one of the best things you can do for your car if you're on a budget ceramic coating is really good and thank you for watching guys I really appreciate it and I thank you for giving me your 13 or 14 minutes and I really appreciate it please do subscribe to the channel hit the like button make sure your bell icon is turned on so you don't miss my future videos and I will definitely see you on the next one